this probably is the most significant thing that two people who are getting uh, toward the end of their lives could do to uh, hasten the time when uh, in our own lifetime we might see America live up to its dreams. We recruited the riders for the Freedom Ride by contacting all of our core chapters around the country. We were looking for a mix of, of black, white, young, middle-aged, older. We wanted to have one member of the clergy on the trip. The Freedom Rides were trying to say to America, we are a diverse country, let's act like a diverse country where every part of the, di of the diversity is equal and it's treated equally. We started out with 14 Protestant ministers, eight white and six black, and four reform rabbis. And we wound up uh, with 10 of us getting arrested. We cannot submit to immoral laws which demand that we separate racially. Nor can we conscientiously avoid entirely the situations in which these segregationist laws operate contrary to laws of the land. The Freedom Rides were not all just about black people. We had many whites and other nationalities and things who went along with what we were doing, and they were, they were doing exactly what we were doing. They were allowing themselves to be abused in this effort. Part of the disbelief that people had uh, around the country um, was the surprise in learning that, that just simple things like um, eating at a lunch counter at a bus station, if you did it interracially or if you went to the wrong waiting room, you could get beat up. When we got to Birmingham, James Peck and I, we were scheduled to uh, test the facilities. When we got in the terminal, the wall was surrounded by men and they all came towards us. And uh, they just started beating on us. And James went down almost immediately. The blood started running. I felt a hard blow and I was on the floor of the bus, face downward. Uh, before long, uh, somebody was on top of me, and then uh, it seemed that we were both being kicked and pushed to the back of the bus. The Freedom Riders introduced the notion that there were whites who were as enraged as we were about uh, racism and about segregation. One major significance of the Freedom Rides was its national character. It was interracial, it was interregional, it was secular and religious. It's a, a kind of tipping point in the history of civil rights struggle. It's a sense of empowerment that an ordinary people can do extraordinary things. That's what the Freedom Rides were all about.